What's good with YouTube? It is your boy Vaughn, and as you guys can see by the title, baby, we are back with a new banger SML reaction video for you guys today. And in this one, we have SML movie Stinkin. I'm, I'm not sure how you say that exactly. I don't know if it's Stinkin or Stinkin. Whatever the case may be, I know it has to do with Ken, the uh, Barbie doll, the male Barbie doll that is uh, that Cody is friends with or whatever. But hey, this just dropped a couple minutes ago. We're gonna check it out right now. The original video will always be in the description down below while you guys are down there. If you'd like to follow me on my other channel, I am posting a video over there after this one. So I would greatly appreciate the support. Make sure you guys are subscribed to this channel with notifications turned on. That way you do not miss any of the uploads, baby. And without further ado, let's dive right into this banger, man. Let's get it. Oh man, Joseph, I love Pizza Palooza. Me too, dude. Pizza Palooza. Like this is Papa John's yeah, so I'm looking awesome. at. Hey guys, sorry I'm late to Pizza Palooza. Yeah, we <laughs> kind of got stuck in a situation. Yes. <laughs> oh my gosh. I can only imagine what situation they got stuck in. Stuck being the operative word. Were you stuck in traffic? No, we walked here. Well, do you want some pizza? Well, I don't think I should be eating <laughs> anything until I am. At least Junior's being generous, trying to offer pizza. Yeah, he stuck up my ass. Oh wait, wait, oh shit. <laughs> His ass is pretty hairy. <laughs> but hey, you when you're an adult, adult that's what happens. Okay, me and Timmy were playing Plug of War. That is not a game. Plug of War? Really to see how strong our sphincters are by putting each end of Ken well, Cody, we don't want to keep... Yeah, this is, this is a look. Oh my gosh, bro. I'm tired of the ayo-ness and zestiness from Cody and Timmy, bro. Like, they, they would have to... If my, look. Here, yeah, please <laughs> they wouldn't be able to be my friend, bro. Stuck up there. But if you look at him, he looks kind of like the Wicked Witch of the East when Dorothy's house landed on her. Except instead of a house, it's my asshole. Well, why don't you just pull Ken out? I tried! Yeah, I was kind of hoping maybe all three of you guys could try pulling. Dude, I'm not touching Ken. It's no telling where the other end of Ken has been. Right. Oh yeah, I thought we were pretty clear. <laughs> Look, I'm not gonna lie to y'all. When it comes to me, bro, and like, like when it comes to like anybody like ever coming around, even when girls, if 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 my girl or like like if when I have a girl, if my girl or any girl that I'm dealing with touches my ass or anything like that, I'm damn near throwing hands. Like I do not touch me there ever. It's a no go. Okay, well, why don't you just call a doctor to help? This is crazy okay, to me right now. At least it won't be an and asking to get help, get help to pull it out, I would be throwing up all over the place, bro. What the fuck? Oh, I forgot. This is insane. Family. I don't know why I thought there would be a cutaway there. Okay, I'll call the doctor. Hey there, somebody call a doctor? <laughs> yeah, he has a doll up his ass. I'm sorry, did you call a doll? No, a doll. Like a Barbie? Oh, a toy doll. Well, that did you fall off a bunk bed into a toy box? No, we were playing plug boy. <laughs> Shouldn't you be in pain, though, no, also, now that I'm thinking sad. about it, bro? Well, this reminds me of the time Matt Ice McGee had a stick stuck up his ass. Who's Mad Eyes McGee? I don't have time to explain it now. Maybe and you gotta have a big ass, ass, ass in order for it. No, I could try to pull them In order for a whole Barbie doll to fit up your shit, bro. Oh, God. Oh, uh, whoa! Oh, <laughs> the Brooklyn guy just used his fucking mouth. What is wrong with this man? Oh, my God. Terrible. Sorry, I had asparagus for dinner last night. And a shitload of pineapple. Ugh, I can still taste this is, it. This is disgusting, bro. <laughs> I want to turn this episode off already, bro. Oh my god. I don't even feel comfortable watching okay, this so right now. <laughs> well, I could put petroleum jelly on there and see if he slides <laughs> out, but the only kind of jelly I have in my glove box What's is funny? Grape. I'll do whatever you What's funny is one time, right, my boy Chris dared me. Petro petroleum jelly. One time I had a dare. I think it was for like $500. They dared me to eat a spoonful of petroleum jelly. I literally scooped up a, it was a big spoonful, guys. Like, uh, it was a glob on there. Okay, five hundred dollars. I was like, what? Or no, it was. It was like it was either it was three hundred or five hundred, one of the two. But I was like, what, nigga? I'll eat this shit right now. Ate that shit. Shit was sliding out of me for the next twenty four hours. Okay, might be TMI, but it was sliding out of me. Literally, you gotta do. Doc. Never again. Okay, I'll go get the jelly. You just stay bent over like that. Oh, that's how we got into this. Man. Petroleum <laughs> jelly works. Just letting y'all know. Ooh, do it. 
All right, you mother smuckers, I got the Concord grape jelly. <laughs> is it weird that I can taste it? <laughs> is it weird that I want to taste it? I thought you were getting petroleum <laughs> jelly. This motherfucker got peanut butter, butter and jelly. This is this is disgusting. I, I don't even want to eat another peanut butter and jelly after this, bro. Like, come on. And do y'all know how slappable peanut butter and jelly is? It smacks. I'm doing a very important procedure here. Okay, kid, I'm going to try to pull it out. Just don't clench, okay? No promises, Doc. <laughs> don't like clench your butt cheeks. I hate this so much. Much. Okay, get ready. Three, two, one. Wait, doctor, he's still missing his head. You have to go back up there and get it. Oh man, Kid, if it's gonna be really deep. I don't know. I know, Ed. Look, just go to the bathroom and try to push it out. Okay. Okay. I sat on the toilet and strained real hard, and this is all the stuff that came out. Let's see. I got a jumbo-sized lollipop. Damn. Oscar, don't know whose that is. I got this Nerf bullet. If all that shit was really up his ass, I would not be allowing this man to even bring it near me. Let alone set it on the couch. Dragon Ball. Gonna have to make another one of those pretty soon. Oh, and I got Ken's head. So let me just put that back on there. Actually, you know what? I should wash him off, too. Okay, Ken's back, and he's all clean. Well, I guess my work here is done. Just don't put anything else up there. No promises. Well, Ken, did you enjoy it? <laughs> Timmy, view? shut up. All right, let's have some pizza. <laughs> Oh, Junior, did you shit your pants? No. Well, something in this room smells like straight-up fart and grape jelly. Maybe it's your butt, because you literally had grape jelly up there. Junior, my butthole is as clean as a whistle. <laughs> How are you, Junior? Empty Coke bottle and you blow <laughs> the fact that Junior was even about to take a bite of pizza is That's insane to me. Hole. Like, <laughs> Okay, well, it's not me, and I don't know what that smell is. Hmm, is it the pizza? No, it's not that. Oh. Oh, Ken, you smell Obviously, it's Ken, yeah, motherfucker. Where did he come from? I washed him up with so much water. Where do you think he came from? No, why would I? Because you're supposed to use soap to clean him. Oh, well, I mean, I guess we could try that, because he is stinking. Is that a word? Well, stinking's a so word. That, so I was right when I was in the intro of the video. I was like, it's either stinking or stink, stinking. 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 Nah, unless you say it like, he be stinking. Yeah, stinking. You know, okay, okay. Like stinking. Okay. okay, well, come on, Ken. Let's get you washed up. <laughs> yeah. All right, now we just have to wait for it to fill up. Doctor, Cody has a big nasty red rash on his tushy. Yeah, I was wiping too much. Now, Cody, you know when you have a poopy tushy, you're supposed to call mommy. You're supposed to say, Mommy, please come wipe me. I oh, know. hell so what no. What are you going to do next time you got a poopy tushy wushy? I'm going to call mommy. That's right. Now, Doctor, Cody needs ointment for his poopy tushy. Now, Cody, apologize to the nice doctor for wasting his time because kids with poopy tushies are bad little owls i'm sorry doctor i'm a bad little owl hoot hoot that's the sound owls make what the hell was that was that the cutaway i asked for a few minutes ago <laughs> why was it late Wh whatever let's just watch ken grab a whole bar of soap okay Okay, he should be all squeaky clean. Let me see. Oh, God, he still smells like crap. No way. <laughs> oh, God, how does he smell worse? <laughs> how do y'all not realize, first of all, how do y'all not realize that he smells like shit walking away from the bathroom? Like, like you should be able to smell him all the way to bringing him back into Junior's presence, right? Oh, I kind of <laughs> like it. It smells like your ass. My ass does oh my not gosh, smell like bro. that. Listen, Cody, you got to throw Ken away. He's disgusting. <clears throat> no, Junior. Well, give him another bath. <laughs> well, I already used a whole bar of I soap. can't stand Why Timmy right now. Washing machine? Why would you use a dead president? What? He said use George Washing Machine. Junior, do you think our first president's name was George Washing Machine? Isn't that his name? No, it's George Washington. Why do you think it's called Washington, D.C.? <laughs> I thought it was Washing Machine, D.C. and the D.C. stood for Delicate Cycle. No, let's go put what? it in the washing machine. <laughs> Junior just oh, made the whole situation the compli Washington more complicated machine. for himself. Let's just throw him in there and then put this on heavy duty. Why not small load? Oh, we never have small loads. Oh, True. my gosh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> I love the way the washing machine vibrates. It's done. Okay, let me just... Get Ken out of there. <laughs> he should smell much better now. Ugh, he still smells like butthole. Why don't we try the dishwasher? Yeah. I guess How about y'all just throw Ken the fuck away and go buy a new Ken? I'm pretty sure there's plenty of more of them. Hell no, in the dishwasher? This is a dishwasher, not a Right, where we eat our fucking food off of it. Cody, he's tripping. I'm not going to clean him in my dishwasher. You're going to get my dishes dirty. Get him out now. I would start spazzing like crazy. I ain't going to lie. to some kind of Chinese spa. Ooh, that's a great idea. And I'll Google ways to clean him in case that doesn't work. Okay. Uh, right there with you. Get my shoulders. Mr. Goodman is naked. I'm weak as fuck. Oh, no. 
Oh, I, I, I've never seen a white Asian person. Like, I'm going to just be honest. It's like... Employees want more money. I personally think that they're overpaid. Nine cents a day is enough. Now get the hot candle wax in my ass. Wait, oh, what? Yankee <laughs> Doodle went to town riding on a pony, stuck a feather in his ass and killed it. Fuck. Oh, no, I'm okay. Of course I'm okay, Rafiki. I used two fingers this time. <laughs> Oh my gosh, bro. They gotta chill on these zesty episodes, man. Fuck. How are you all enjoying your spa day? Oh, it's great. She just got to the good part. Now tell Rafiki and Bing Bong not to forget my happy ending. Mother, don't forget his happy meal. Oh, oh, come on. Oh, hello, sir. Getting more customer walking in. Hello, sir. Welcome to Hong Kong. Whoever, whoever's doing his accent is going fucking crazy, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Go oh, man, uh, yeah, my boyfriend's really sticky. I was just wondering if you guys had like a spa treatment that could make him smell. Oh my gosh. Oh, let me smell. Oh, hurry, shit, he's so tanky. Uh, hurry, no, shit. You. Wait, so you can't help? No, we can give him manicure or pedicure or yum yum right. But you can't give him like a bath or something? What is a yum yum no, right? but we can give him happy ending. No, I can do that. Never mind. <laughs> All right, now I'm going to pull a Deshaun Watson. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> I don't want to know what do the it. fuck is going on in there. I you really don't. Did do you? <laughs> no, of course not. I have you. Okay, good. Just tell Cody your idea to make Ken smell better. Okay, so I googled a bunch of stuff, and the only thing we haven't tried yet is to spray Ken with cologne to make him smell better. Well, that might at least mask. <laughs> cologne shit smells good, but it ain't it ain't gonna do everything. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, oh, no, that didn't work at all. Now he just smells like Macy's and shit. Oh, that was my last idea. A combination. Junior, do you have any ideas to make Ken smell better? We could take a car air freshener. And put it I'm surprised there. Junior hasn't gone home or anything yet. Idea, Cody, don't interrupt. Oh my god, what happened to your face? Wait, what the? I'm allergic to. Oh, he's allergic to cologne. Cologne. I'm allergic to my colon. He said cologne, my boy. Oh, no, right. it's definitely a stretch, especially the Cody. Like, it's not supposed to stretch, but it totally does. Guys, I'm dying! Okay, guys, don't move. I watched a TikTok that'll help Cody this. looks fucking terrible. What? Junior, what the fuck are you doing? A TikTok you know what a TikTok dance. dance. If you heard the music that goes Stop with this, it. it was crazy. Yes, Junior, Stop it. Sure it's a very sick dance, but I'm dying over here. I would call 911, but my phone's downstairs. I would call 911, but my phone died from watching TikTok. Somebody get a goddamn phone. Okay, rock, paper, scissors, who gets their phone? Okay. Ed, Ed, Nettie. Boop. Boop, boop. Classy. What y'all know? What y'all know about Ed, Ed and Eddie, man? That's one of the most goaded cartoons on Cartoon Network when I was growing up from my childhood, baby. I used to watch that shit every day. I loved Ed, Ed and Eddie, man. <laughs> They're gonna do it. Okay, I'll go grab my phone, but you have to let it charge first. Timmy, go get your phone. No, I'm gonna. They didn't even finish. I thought they was going to. But I can't breathe. Hey there, somebody call a doctor. Oh God, what's wrong with you? He got a motherfucking flamingo nose right now. Ew. No, no, no. He's allergic to cologne. Oh, that makes so much more sense. I need an EpiPen. Oh well, I don't have an EpiPen, but uh. I do have a weed pen out in my car. Mm, I like those. You want to hit that fucking shit, bro? <laughs> you you want to hit that shit? With you? <laughs> <laughs> no. I, Brooklyn guy, we don't fucking condone. We don't influence kids to do drugs. Stop it. <laughs> no. <laughs> we need an EpiPen. Oh, my God. You're such a square. Well, I don't have an EpiPen, but I do have this other pen that I like <laughs> to click when I'm thinking, but I don't know where that is right now, so... I'm all out of ideas. Okay, well, is he gonna die if he doesn't get his EpiPen? Well, let me take a look at him. Mm, no, I don't think he's gonna die. But he looks like he's gonna die. Right. I'm a doctor. He looks okay, pretty okay, fucking I horrible. Two years of online community <laughs> college. I think I am more than qualified to say if he's gonna die or not. But Brooklyn, guy, I don't think you're qualified at any job that you do, doctor. honestly. But oh, that's yeah, just my personal like, opinion. I'm Maybe a hot a take. Let me know how you guys feel. <laughs> your father was arrested in 1993 for dressing up like a girl and being a prostitute. What's crazy is 1993. I wasn't even born yet. <laughs> and I'm 30. Yeah, so uh, he doesn't need an EpiPen. He'll be fine. Wait, what is that awful poop smell? Oh, is this Ken doll? Wait, hold on. No, he smells like cologne. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Yeah, he does smell like cologne, but I still smell the poop. Oh, God, it's you. 
Wait, 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 kid, did you poop your pants? Yeah. <laughs> wait, don't you accuse me of pooping my pants? I know. So you knew the whole time? Yeah. Can we please, like, fix please Cody's face? Like, because this is kind of disturbing. <laughs> I know, but my pants were just so poopy. Well, kid, you know I'm going to have to tell your parents now, right? Please, no. I'm sorry. I They're can't. laughing in the background. <laughs> Gotta go tell the tushy monster. Cody, is what the doctor told me true? Do you really have a poopy tushy? Yeah. Why didn't you call mommy to come and wipe you? Because my tushy was so poopy. Oh, Cody. Now you're gonna get a rat. Bruh. Y'all better wipe y'all ass when y'all go to the bathroom. That's all I gotta say. Wipe your ass. And also, most importantly, wash your hands afterwards. Please. <laughs> Why didn't you make it to the toilet? Or you're going to end up like Cody. Well, because I had a lollipop up my ass and a Rubik's Cube and Master Chief and an Oscar <laughs> and a really big Sharpie and a Dragon Ball. And when I took all that stuff out, it was like a tsunami of doo-doo. <laughs> oh, Cody. Apologize to your friends for making such a big stink. I'm sorry, guys. I'm a poopy little... Journey owl. doesn't know what the fuck is going on. <laughs> Come on, Cody. Let's take that poopy tushy back home. <laughs> yeah, this episode was, uh... Oh, man. Quite disgusting, if I'm being honest. Um... Yeah, original video will always be in the description down below while you guys are down there. If you like to follow me on my other channel, I am uploading a video after this one over there. So I will greatly appreciate the support. Thank you guys for all the love and everything, man. It truly means a lot. I love y'all and I will see you guys tomorrow, baby. We are out. Peace.